Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how we can fix the error WebDriver Chrome. Um, the error is demonstrated as session not created exception and this version of Chrome driver only supports Chrome version 81. Um, some of you may get um, this Chrome driver only supports Chrome version 83 or other depending on what Chrome driver you have in. So now I'm gonna let let's start. Uh, first, you need to open your Chrome uh, to any page. What you do is to identify the version of Chrome that you are use using. Um, here you can go to the uh, About, and here you can see this is the, your version. All right. So now what you need to do is to download the suitable um, driver, Chrome driver. Okay, so in my case, it's version A1. So what I'm going to do is to um, web driver for Chrome A1. All right. If if it is 83 in your case, then feel free to do so to fix it to 83. Uh, from and then what you need to do is to download the suitable version. I'm not going to download 83 because my Chrome version A1. So click ahead and then i will choose the suitable if you use using mac or linux or from in my case i'm using the uh, windows so i'm going to click on here okay now what you need to do is just to download it and then extract i already have it one um, after you download it please uh, extract it okay extract it so that's the first step um, what is the second step then you need to go to you go to the OS disk and um, create a folder with any name. This can create a folder named bin and put um, the Chrome driver in this folder. Um, this will be the folder that we point to when the next time we start our Chrome driver. Um, just in order to get driver here, it's just other file that I put for my work. All right, um, now. Usually, um, what you would do is that when you import Selenium and you know, Selenium import to web driver, if you start this function driver webdriver.chrome, it will work. It will work normally, but if it doesn't work, which is what we are trying to fix, is that you're gonna use this one, and you're gonna point the path to this okay I'm gonna point the path to this remember we create a bin folder um, you can change it to the name of your folder you create but in my case I create a bin folder and then we we point to exactly this web driver okay and then you you run it uh, for my situation I have used this and have successfully resolved issue um, so now I can just go ahead and um, start the web driver in my case. Hopefully this video can help you to fix the problem with your uh, with your computer. Thanks, thanks for watching.